that's Stark there. This is Banner here. How do you know the name? Because I know that. Oh, look it. See, he's this liking you. Here. They love you. He is so good with animals. They just come to him. We call him our animal whisperer. Well, clearly, because they weren't being very interactive. And oh, really? With other people? Yeah, they came down for a minute, but they didn't really stay down for They're coming to visit you, Kyla? You like that? What are these? These are dingoes. They're dingoes? wild dogs from Australia. Wild dogs from Australia. When their tail's wagging, what does that mean? Same thing as a normal dog. Just, Just they're happy. happy. They're content. Not really. They don't really act like normal dogs in a sense of like the mentality uh, wise. Oh, they're, they're fighting. No, they're not fighting. But yeah, no, they, these guys, physically they look like dogs, and body language wise they are like dogs, but when it comes to mentality of them, they're wild dogs, meaning they have that wild side to them, so these guys are not tame. They're not tame. No, they're not. Well, what these ones are called is uh, what we call socialized, which basically means they've been introduced to humans at a young age and raised with them, so that way they're more likely to accept people and let people come in and interact with them and not be aggressive. But like if you go out in the wild, these guys would probably be a lot more aggressive for you. Eventually. What's going on? What's going on? Yeah, they kind of had a bit of a long day yesterday, so they're not quite as, as I was saying, like, interested. At least they came up and said hi to you. Yeah. What do you feed them? Uh, so mainly they get raw chicken as their main diet, but sometimes they will get like beef and other stuff as well. Um, they're plays. <laughs> 